What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black walkthrough. Okay, so, we finally got to Nat Green City. Figured out that, you know, there's a few things here and there that we can actually accomplish. You know, battle the gym leader, defeat in, get a few good doodads and all that stuff, like the Mystic Water and all that crud. But we still realize that we're not strong enough to take on uh, the gym leader right now. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go in straight to the next route right here, which will be Route 4, I believe. Is it Route 4? No, it's the Pinwheel Forest. Wow. So it turns out that this whole thing is the Pinwheel Forest. And now all we got to do is talk to this person. And he's going to be like, Yo, Traveling Trainer, are your Pokemon getting stronger? Here, this might come in handy. And we get ourselves the TM94 Rock Smash. A very good move, especially since we're going to be battling a gym leader that has normal type Pokemon. Rock Smash is a move that sometimes reduces your foe's defense stat. It is super effective against normal type Pokemon, which the Gym Leader Nora likes. Okay, so that's a little secret weapon that we have right here. And, uh, well, what we're going to do in this episode right here is we're going to be battling everybody. Everybody. Every freaking buddy. And, uh, well, let's see. First is first. Let's go ahead and give that Mystic Water we got in the last episode to Sigh of the Torrent. And, uh, let's see. Hmm. We don't have any of that stuff. Um, uh, oh, yes. Uh, let's see. We're going to be giving Rock Smash to a good old Pokemon of ours. He needs an extra move. Yes, we can give it to Ace right here. Every single one of these guys can actually learn a fighting type move, but kind of need Ace with this one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take away Helping Hand. Don't really have a lot of double battles right here. So there you go. Rock Smash. Especially since, uh, you know, Ace is a more of a physical attacker than anything. So let's go right ahead and start battling people. If you go straight, it doesn't take long, but if you go the wrong way, it's a maze. Is Pinwheel Forest a path or a maze to you? Hmm, I think it's both. I don't even know. Okay, so here's a cool thing about this person right here. Now, this is a nurse. You'll be able to find nurses and doctors around uh, Unova right here. You battle them, and then after that, they will heal your Pokemon for you. So, we're going to do that in just a little bit. But first, there's an item right here that needs our attention. And yes, we grab ourselves the Ether. Alrighty. A good ether right there. Okay. And uh, well, let's go right ahead and battle this lady right here. So let's see. Are you going deeper into Pinwheel Forest or to challenge a rock? Either way, unless you are tough, you'll just get rooted in onto the spot. Okay. Okay, bring it on. Let's go, Nurse. I think her nurse is Shelly or something. She does come out with a Muna. Muna's looking like a, you know. Amuna and all that crud. And, uh, well, let's go right ahead and just destroy him with a tackle attack right here. Look at that. Tackle attack for the win. Nope, not for the win. And here comes that imprison attack, which, yeah, sealed any kind of similar moves that it may have with my Pokemon. But let's go right ahead and go with that uh, Razor Claw or Razor uh, Clam. Razor Shell, I should say. Yeah, buddy. Alrighty, and look at that. Welcome to level 19. How's it going right there? Feels good, right? Feels very, very good. Now, if you want to battle Lenora right away, may I suggest coming into this uh, this route right here? You will be able to find a few rock or no, a few fighting type Pokemon. Uh, one being uh, Soccer Throw, depending on what version you're playing, and uh, what was it, Timber? Yeah, but they're gonna be uh, they're gonna be tough to train, but they're gonna be useful when you fa when you face uh, Lenora. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna continue just training my Pokemon, and uh, you know what? I don't need to be attacked by any wild Pokemon right here. So what I'm going to do is a repel comes in handy either way. So let's go right ahead and just uh, take care of business right here. And there's nothing that we can see right here. But this person is going to be looking at us right now. Alrighty. Bring it. Okay. Let's go. Here we go with uh, Preschooler Juliet coming with her Cuttany. Did I choose the right Pokemon? I want to know if I chose the right Pokemon for this, and yes, here comes Ace. Let's do this. Alrighty, Ace. Let's go. Let's go with uh, the Bite Attack, and hopefully uh, it takes him out. One punch, maybe? I don't know. Nope, but it takes a huge chunk out of its HP, and here comes that Mega Drain. Oh, God. Of course, it will heal it up automatically, so I guess the bo the best move to go to is Takedown right here. So there it is, Takedown Attack. Alrighty. And that is how you do it. Yeah, buddy. Level 18. Yes, our Pokemon are leveling up pretty well right there. 
And she will be coming out with a pet a little, so I'm just gonna continue on right here with an ace. Let's get this ace. Let's go. Takedown attack for the win. Man, that takedown is gonna do us some wonders, but it also takes a lot of uh, HP just to just to get it out there, so it's kind of bad. Kind of it is. Okay, so let's see. Uh, there is an item right here that we need to get, and that is another great ball, which is always good. And uh, let's see. Now we gotta battle this guy right here. All right, look at us. Pay attention to us and all that stuff. What do you have to say? Hi, hi, trainer. I will, uh, I will let you see what kind of Pokemon I have. Well, what kind of Pokemon do you have? I don't know. Let's see. Preschooler Homer. Not Homer Simpson, just Homer. And he will be coming out with the Rog and Rolla. And it looks like I chose the right Pokemon for this one right here. So, uh, let's see. No, I chose the incorrect Pokemon. Crud. Or did I? Here we go with the Rock Smash right here. It is uh, super effective against fighting or uh, rock types. But here it comes with its Rock Blast. And, uh, yeah, that is... That hits you in multiple, tr or it hits you multiple times, all in one hit. So he is nearly taking us out right there. So let's go right ahead and go with Sigh of the Torrent right here. Yeah. Oh yes. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Bring it on. Give me that rock uh, blast. See what would happen. That's one. That's two. Nothing. Okay. Water gun for the win. Yes. Yeah, buddy. Of course, we already hit it one time. So, it's, you know, that that whole effect they had on me. No, it's not going to beat me. So now, let's go right ahead and heal our Pokemon. So, let's see. Where is that Super Potions? Right there. And we're going to give that to Ace right here. And, uh, you know what? I'm going to switch out my Pokemon. Let's go straight to Drillmonger right here. And, oh, wow. Didn't. And let's see what it can do. Let's see what it can do right here because it also needs to be trained just a little bit and thankfully we have a repel to just make sure we don't get attacked by any of these uh pokemon right here and here comes another challenger let's see what you got to say okay i'm brave and i'm bold let's get right to battle okay all righty so here we go another pokemon battle against youngster kieta kaita kita don't know whatever and uh, I may have chosen the incorrect Pokemon for this one right here. Maybe. I don't even know. All right, Drillmonger. Fury swipes. Let's get this. Swipe that. Swipe that. Yeah, buddy. Swipe that. Okay, so that was three times. Took half its HP, but we're going to get hit right here. What kind of a move would that... Oh, it's our, our attack would fall, so... Crud. Kind of messed up just a little bit right here, so... Let's go Fury swipes. Come on. Give me a cure! Oh, good God! So nothing whatsoever, and uh, oh God, this Pokemon is—he's uh, playing around with us. So let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go straight to Ace, so he can take care of the rest right here. Alrighty. Okay. Okay. All right. Take away my, take away my uh, my attack right there. So let's go right ahead. And finish you off with the takedown attack because now, oh crud! And uh, yeah, okay. So here we go again with another confusion. Don't like that. So let's go right ahead and go with a freaking bite attack. Yes, it works. That's right. That's that's how you do it right there. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. So here he comes out with another time pull. So let's go right ahead and go back to Drillmonger and see if we have better luck with this guy now that you know. It's no longer confused, or its attack is no longer taken away, you know, that kind of stuff. And, uh, well, here he comes out with uh, another time pull. Let's go! Fury Swipes! There we go. Fury Swipes. Taken out. Yeah, that's right. Critical hits. Let's go! Come on! Finish him off! Damn it! It only had six. And here comes that bubble beam. And it really hit us pretty hard right there, so... Finish this guy off with the Fury Swipes. I get it, guys. Not that strong right now, but eventually you will learn some stronger moves. And look at that. Level 15. Finally. And it's learning Metal Claw, which is... Eh, it's, it's, a, it's a decent move. It's a decent move. It will heighten up its attack little by little on some random turns and all that stuff. So there you go, guys. Metal Claw. And uh, he's going to be coming out with another me 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 time pool. So let's go back to Ace right here and see what we can do. 
Okay. Bring it. Just bring it right here. Time pool is looking like one tough little cookie right there. Look at that. It, it's a tadpole and everything. I remember when I was in third grade, uh, the high school right next to a uh, right next to my my third grade school. Cause uh, when I went to, when I went to the to school on in third grade, we had a third grade specific school next to the high school. There was like a I guess a farm out there, and a whole bunch of tadpoles were like birthing over there. You know that kind of stuff. They were birthing over there, and for a little project at the beginning of the year, our teacher got a few tadpoles here and there, put them inside the class as, as a as a class pet, and those things just you know we got to see those things grow up to become little frogs. And luckily, by the time school was done, they did become frogs, and it was it was a, it was actually pretty cool to remember the good old times, you know, when you were a kid and everything surprised you. That was always awesome, right there. Okay. So we got that, and the repel has worn off. Before we do anything else, let's go ahead and still heal our Pokemon right here. Ace needs a, you know, a nice boost right there. And uh, so does Drillmonger. Okay, so we got three Pokemon right now. And uh, I do have an idea of what I want for the next team member. But it won't be until later on. You guys probably already know who it is, or what it is. You guys probably have an idea, because everybody goes there to get this one Pokemon. Or two, or three. I don't even know. Believe it or not, it might be in... The last three might be in the same location at once. I could be wrong, I don't even know. So here he comes out with the Venipede, and I'm coming with Drillmonger. So I may or may not have the type advantage right here. Yes, I do. Eat this, Mud Slab, for the win. Oh wait, it's not super effective, god dang it. Alrighty, so I avoid any kind of confrontation right there. So here we go again, Mud Slab, let's get this. Yeah, that's right, you will not hurt me at all because you are blinded blind blind just like a blind person okay so there we go another blindness and the screech attack actually works this time okay so let's go ahead and finish this guy off with something that we just learned metal claw right here metal claw there we go nearly takes him out and here comes a pursuit attack Jesus criminy okay so let's go again metal claw for the win look at that Okay, alrighty, okay, oh, look at that, Drillmonger's looking like, uh, yeah, he's looking like he can beat anybody, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go straight back to Ace, get this shit going right here, that's right, let's get it Ace, alrighty, Lillipup, looking all strong and everything, but it will not defeat me, so here we go, Rock Smash, for the win, yeah, buddy. Oh, nearly takes him out, but that defense goes down. It's always nice. Oh, God. Odor Sleuth is always nice. Here we go. Alrighty, okay. Okay, there we go. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Level 19 Ace. So it's growing up nicely. And, uh, yeah, he just caught his Pokemon, but it's all alright. Okay, so let's go ahead and switch out our Pokemon right here. Now let's go with Sigh of the Torrent since it's, uh, you know, it needs to grow up a little bit more in order to defeat these guys right here. Now, there will be some Pokemon that you can actually find right here. So I'm going to avoid those Pokemon because, yeah, so let's go with the Repel right here. And, uh, alrighty, bring it on, ladies and gents. I test the Challenge Rock with my fist every day. It is important to make a steady progress little by little. Kind of sounds like a, yeah, it kind of sounds like a Chinese, Japanese movie. Those karate movies in uh, popularity in the 80s, you know, that kind of stuff. Alrighty, so here she comes out with a Timber, a Pokemon you can actually find in this area. Okay, alrighty, so here we go, bring it on. Let's go with the Razor Shell. Yeah. That's right. And, uh, well, another Razor Shell will actually do as well right here. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Razor Shell does its thing. Defeats Lee. Don't know what this uh, whole this whole uh, challenge rock will do to us, but you know it'll be something. Now I believe there's a hidden item here somewhere. Maybe I don't even know. Could be wrong. Let's see. I don't know. Uh, challenge rock. It's a challenge rock. Now uh, comment down below, guys. Seriously, comment down below. Let me know what this challenge rock does. If it has any significant meanings or anything like that, then just let me know. Okay. Yeah, because, again, I'm still laying out the land and all that crud. So, let's go ahead and battle this guy. I trained and trained like a madman, and my Pokemon trained even more. 
All right, madman. Okay, let's go. Bring it on. Uh, here we go with uh, Timber. And I'm coming back with this guy right here. Sigh of the Torrent. Okay, alrighty. Alright, Sigh of the Torrent. Let's go, Razor Shell. Let's just destroy all these people. Get this mug right here. That's right. And, uh, yeah, it takes away a, a few of its points right there. So, we're gonna take another hit right here. And here we go, Razor Shell. That's right. Finish him off. No more timber. Literally timber. And there you go. Sigh of the Torrent. Continuing its uh, excellence of, uh, of execution right there. Bre Bret Hart. And uh, let's see. What is this item right here? Found ourselves a netball. Always good for us, you know, to capture some different Pokemon and all that stuff. And, uh... Okay, so... Let's see. We're... Okay, so now... I think we're close to being done right here. Let's see. Uh, okay, so yeah, the repel has worn off. I do not want to get attacked by any of these Pokemon right now. So let's get that repel and uh, alrighty, let's get this right here. Super potion for the win. Okay, and uh, well, let's see. There's nobody here, so I think we're done with this area right here. So. That is pretty much it right there for this episode, guys. Uh, off screen, I will be training my Pokemon just a little bit more because I kind of don't feel confident right now with them. Uh, in the next episode, we will be battling uh, Lenora of the uh, Sacred City Gym. And uh, yeah, comment down below if you guys are, are willing to help out with, you know, uh, tips of what to do here in uh, Pokemon Black. Because again, hardly play Pokemon Black a lot. The only two times I've ever played it, yeah. I did it for walkthroughs and it was very unsuccessful. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.